Campbell takes on Southern Illinois Edwardsville on senior night, and the Fighting Camels would take advantage early. The Walker twins, Drew and Tyler, would get early takedowns and use these massive mat returns to establish some dominance in the 125 and 133 weight classes. Tyler would win by decision. Drew would win through forfeit because of injury. After this mat return injured the shoulder of his opponent, Patrick Myers, who was unable to continue. Campbell would continue its dominance in the lighter weight classes as senior Brent George won by technical fall 18-3, giving CU a 14-3 lead in the overall score. Greg Blumenthal looks like he's in a bad situation here, but gets out of it and helps his team with a 5-4 decision. However, the Cougars would storm back and take the lead 18-17 with one match remaining. And it's the heavyweight senior Elohim Palma in his last regular season match at home against David Devine. Palma would get a couple of key takedowns to take the lead, but Devine would claw back. However, the Cary North Carolina native would not let CU down, avoiding multiple attempts in the final minute to be taken down and secured the victory 8-6 as Campbell came back to win 20-18 on Palmer's three-point win. The win gets CU to 5-1 and one on the year in the Southern Conference and guarantees at least a third-place finish in the regular season. CU has one more conference match against the Citadel in Chapel Hill on Saturday before hosting the Southern Conference Wrestling Championship on March the 8th inside Gore Arena. After the match, Coach Joe Boardwine was happy to see his seniors come through on senior night. Yeah, well, I thought Brent wrestled awesome. Uh, I mean, he did exactly what you need from a senior, uh, coming out getting bonus points, which was great. So great to see him go out that way. I think he started wrestling. We just talked in, at age five or six, so he's been in it for a long time. So it was good to see him go out with a win at home. That was good. And, uh, you know, Elohim came back um, and won the match for us, so we really needed him there. He stepped up big, and, you know, their heavyweight's tough. He beat the Chattanooga heavyweight. He's, you know, one of the top guys in the country. So he's had, he has some good wins, and it got pretty dicey at the end there. So.